We're a 70 plus year old company, family business that turned uh, ESOP or employee owned. Our foray into barriers, we decided as an organization to pivot into using the extrusion products that we represent um, in a fashion that was providing people with health and safety. Uh, call them screens, like sand guards, barriers. Uh, there's so many different trade names for them out there now. We're very focused on our financials, which most companies are in order to stay in business, but we realize that we have a responsibility that's really much greater than just dollars and cents. Everyone pitched in to make it work. We had our engineers offering free design support, our fabricators manufacturing all these barriers right on our shop floor, our shippers and installers delivering these barriers. And because of all this hard work, we were able to manufacture over 4,000 of them to various hospitals and schools and factories. Anyone who wanted to really get back to work, we were there for them. And this is something we were very, very proud of. You hear so much in the news about um, parents struggling with the at-home schooling and um, teachers being afraid to come back into the classroom and, and they're all valid concerns. And uh, so we as an organization thought, how can we help that process? How can we get help get people back into a, the environment that uh, really promotes learning? I myself have a middle schooler and she has been afforded the opportunity to be in school this entire time. It's been a wonderful gift for us and for her. We're excited about the fact that we are able to participate in this effort. There's an opportunity to give back and um, really to one of the finest things in the world in terms of providing people with an education. And uh, we know that that is something that separates our children and their uh, ability to be successful later in life. We're excited about this opportunity and um, hope that everybody returns back to normal at some point in time and we stop saying the new normal.